So we're in the heart of Italy. There's this weird bombed out building. It's so cool looking. This was a hotel that was actually blown up during World War II. And it's been like this ever since. Wow. Imagine the history beneath our feet. This is actually a spa. And there are thermal springs here, your hot water springs. And uh, that dates back to uh, the Romans. The Romans actually had developed it originally. Of course, these aren't Roman ruins, but uh, they probably, I don't know how long, how far back they go, but probably at least the 1800s or 1700s, maybe even earlier, I don't know. But at some point during World War II, they got blown up and they never came back. Has served at one time, but look at that! Wow! Oh, look at this! It's like a cave. Oh, wow! Look at this! Tunnels! There's tunnels here. I don't have my flashlight with me, unfortunately. Love it. Oh, it stinks. I wonder if that's a badger hole. Looks like someone's been digging this out. Look, those big rocks have been moved. Oh, there's a whole complex back here. Look. Those are stoves or something. It's no motorcycle. How old that is? Probably not too. That big beam in there, the tree. Big round beams holding things up. Look at that. That's a beautiful arch. Kind of cattywampus. Very interesting work, stonework in here. Watch your head for that, though. You don't want your rocks falling on our noggins while we're in here. I forgot that I had my cell phone on me, so we'll use that light to explore. Look. Maybe this was like a wine cellar. Oh, it stinks. Smells like bodies back here. Watch your step. Little poops. That looks like a weasel poop to me. Or ferret poop. I thought I saw something looking at me. I wonder if this is his look. It's collapsed. We can't go any further. That probably went into a big wine cellar. I bet if we go up on top, there'll be a big hole in the ground. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, it's hideous. Giant spiders, look at that giant spider. Right, so let's go ahead and get out of here before we have spiders on our backs. Or millipedes or centipedes, whatever they were. I wonder what this big piece of machinery is. I just can't quite figure it out. If you look here, some big rollers. Big one here and there's one over there. It's almost like scaffolding that would go up. Maybe it's holding the building together. It's definitely not scaffolding. <laughs> it's too much, too massive. It's massive. Look, they walled that uh, door off at one point before this was destroyed. I just love those beams up there, those round beams. Oh no, it's over there. Look, it keeps going and going and going. I like how this window sill is here, and they cut a groove. I've never really seen this before. See how there's a groove cut? You'd think it might be ornamental, but I bet it's probably to keep, yeah, that's what it is, is to keep the water. When the water collects here, it'll get in this groove and then run out instead of staying up against the wood and uh, making the wood rot. 
Little drains. I've never seen that before. But I guarantee that's what it is. All right, so we're going to have to scoot out of here. I'm sorry the video is so short. I just don't have a lot of time today. And I'll probably never be back here. So I want to... Oh, just look at that. <laughs> it's so dangerous. Look at that floor. Wow. <laughs> that door is... uh walled off too. I wonder why they would wall them off. And this one, that looks a little more recent. The bricks look newer. Yeah, we probably shouldn't go in there anyway. We got a brick on our head, that would ruin our trip. All right, well, that's it. This is probably my only old building exploration in Italy, but it was a fun one. <laughs> All right, so let's scoot on out of here. Hey, 